There it is. Doing its job. All right, I got the Kyosho Outdoor Solar Lights. I love solar lights. My whole backyard's full of them. And let's check these guys out and see what we get here. This was sent to me for evaluation purposes, but all opinions are my own. First of all, I'd like to say, nice packaging. Nice looking box. Great gift idea. Solar lights. Great for the garden. Pathway. All kinds of stuff. So, right away, these things are packed in bubble wrap. That's what you want to see. They arrive safely. I'm telling you, this is going to be pretty easy. There's really not a whole lot to setting up solar lights if you've never done it before. So it comes with a user manual, a little set of instructions. There's really not a whole lot to these things. If you can't figure it out yourself, you can always refer to the manual. It comes with the two lights itself and two sticks for putting it in the ground. It comes with some mounting hardware. Hey, you got two holes in the bottom here. If you wanted to mount this to something, you know, you can mount it up there. You've got a nice 90 degree coverage right there. If that's what you want to do, that's kind of a cool idea. Otherwise, pretty simple. You just take the stake, stick it in there, and you're good to go. How easy is that? I wonder if these things are powered up when we cover up the solar light. Yep, look at that. We've got low light, medium light, and high light. So it has three light intensities on it. Low, medium, and high. I'm covering up the solar panel so it thinks it's outside. Another good thing about these solar lights is they're IP67 waterproof. Obviously, you're not going to be sinking these into a bathtub or something, but they'll be fine in all kinds of weather conditions, rain. These things are good from negative 4 degrees Fahrenheit or negative 20 degrees Celsius to 122 degrees Fahrenheit or 50 degrees Celsius. So pretty good range of weather conditions that these work in. These things have two eyes each on them with a total of 38 individual LED lights. You can spin this all the way down to here if you wanted to. Point it almost down to the ground and straight up in the sky. So plenty of range of motion on there if you're gonna be highlighting a tree or even a pathway or whatever you decide to use these for. So we're gonna charge these guys up. And then we're going to test them out this evening and see how they work. You don't need the button to be in the on position for these to charge up. You can just charge them as they are. And we'll come back later and see how they work at night. All right, so I've had these things out charging in the sun. It says you should charge them for a couple of days. So I've had them out here for two days, two and a half days or so, charging in the sunlight. I've got this one aimed right up on my Chicago fig. And I've got this one set up over here so it kind of shines a light towards my birdhouse. That little setting there, so... Tonight we'll come out and we'll see what they look like in the nighttime. What do you think, Rigatoni? Good boy. Absolutely pouring rain. There it is. Doing its job. It's working. See that spotlight? It really has my tree lit up. That's pretty cool. There's my birdhouse all lit up. That's on the high setting. Remember, there's three settings on here low, medium, and high. That's the high. It is pouring rain. And still lighting up the tree really nice. Looks great. So if you're looking for an affordable pair of outdoor solar spotlights to light up your pathway, sidewalk, palm tree, favorite tree, bush, house, whatever, check out the Kyosho 2-pack of outdoor solar spotlights. Check them out.